Thank you very much for visiting my channel. If not difficult, like and subscribe to my channel to always be aware of events. Thank. He took to the National Television Awards stage on Thursday evening to accept this morning's Best Daytime Award. And despite the victory, Philip Schofield was left flustered as one guest later probed him on the recent Qgate controversy, leaving the presenter to awkwardly respond with a gushing ode to his fans. The presenters found themselves at the center of the Qgate controversy in September when they were accused of skipping the queue to see the Queen lying in state, which they both denied. But as he extended thanks, many viewers took to social media to display the disbelief that the show had scooped the gong, demanding for him to hand it back. Philip and Holly faced considerable backlash, with a petition for the presenters to be removed from television altogether reached 73,000 signatures. And despite still winning the NTA amid the drama, the pair were reportedly booed by fans while making their way to the stage. One journalist took to Twitter to film Phil after accepting his award, probing the presenter. Phil do you think this vindicates you for Qgate? Do you think now the public have said, actually we don't care about Qgate? Smirking, he simply responded. We are so grateful for our amazing viewers. We love them. And taking to social media. Fans were quick to slam Holly and Phil following the win. Demanding they hand the award back due to recent controversy. You should have handed it back and let a more deserving show have it. Wrote one viewer to Instagram. While another penned. Clearly the UK has forgiven Philip Schofield. What a joke. But while Phil appeared to be brushing off the scandal, partner in crime Holly dipped out of the bash earlier. The pair are notoriously known to be the last two standing each year. But according to The Sun, Holly departed the awards show, held at London's Ovo Arena Wembley, about a half an hour after she accepted the award. A source said, Holly picked up her award for best daytime and then left 30 minutes after. Normally she stays around for a drink with Phil and the team, but she did an Irish exit. She was seen leaving the ceremony and getting into a car outside just after 10 p.m. Getting on stage to accept the award earlier. Philip said, please don't think we ever get complacent and please don't think we ever take it for granted. This means so much to us every year, especially this year. We have the best boss. Holly added, this morning has a very special relationship with you. You make our show for us. You really do. All these guys on the stage here. Allison, Hammond, and Dermot, O'Leary, Rochelle, Humes, and Vernon, Kay, Josie, Gibson, everyone. Thank you for all your support. After winning the award, Holly took to Instagram and shared a snap of the pair together, writing, Thank you, holy moly, we love you. At this morning, you are the best team. You work so hard to make the show what it is. We want to thank each and every one of you for voting. You have made this night an absolute dream. Thank you also at Officiantas for having us. At Joel Domit, you are a class act. It comes as their Q Fiorori began on Friday, September 16, when the presenter's approach was contrasted with that of football legend David Beckham the same day. The former England captain waited in line for almost 14 hours to pay his respects to the Queen, despite being offered a pass by an MP to jump the queue. Good Morning presenter Susanna Reid also won plaudits for waiting for seven hours with her mother to file past the coffin. New drama Heartstopper This is going to hurt time trigger point. Winner talent show Britain's Got Talent RuPaul's Drag Race UK Strictly Come Dancing. Winner the Masked Singer author documentary. Julia Bradbury. Breast Cancer and Me Kate Garraway. Caring for Derek. Winner Katie Price, 
What Harvey did next Paddy and Christine McGuinness, Our Family and Autism Tom Parker. Inside My Head Returning Drama Bridgerton Call the Midwife Peaky Blinders, Winner The Split TV Presenter, Alison Hammond Anth.